I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you solution of a question from my subscriber. Let me thank him first for asking this question. We are working on mean of numbers and this time we have taken fractures as our numbers. The question here is find the average value of the following three fractions 5 over 8, 2 over 5 and 3 over 4. So average means what? Average means you have to add them all and divide by the number of numbers, right? So to find average value, you need to add all numbers. And then divide by number of numbers. So in this case, we are given fractions. So basically, what you need to do is to add these three fractions, which is 5 over 8 plus 2 over 5 plus 3 over 4, and divide by number of these numbers, 1, 2, 3. So divide by the number 3. This is what is the average value. Now the question is, how to add these fractions? To add fractions, we should have common denominator right now lowest common multiple is what so now we have to look for common denominator so basically we look for the lowest common denominator so we'll write the word lowest here so l c d let me use sometimes use d or we say lowest common multiple also right so between 8, 5, and 4, what is the LCM? LCM is 40. Right? So 8 times 5 is 40. 4 goes 2 times in 8. So everything works, right? So 40 is the lowest common multiple for these three numbers. So basically, we need to ensure that all of them could be written as equivalent fractions with 40. So what we will do here is, We'll write them with 40 denominators. So 5 over 8 could be multiplied by 5, both numerator and denominator. And then what do you get? We get 5 times 5 is 25. So we get 25 over 8. How about this one? 2 over 5 times 5, which is 40, right? So we multiplied both by 5. To make it 40, we have to multiply both by 8. So we get 16 over 40. And in this case, by 10, so we get 30 over 40, correct? And everything divided by 3. So we could also say everything times 1 over 3. Do you see? That is also divided by 3. By doing so, we have cut on one layer of fraction. Do you see that part? Okay. So here, let's add the numerators. So we have 40 as a common denominator. The numerators are... 5 times 5, 25, plus 16, plus 30. And we'll multiply this by 1 third. So that is divided by 3. Is it okay? Right. So 5 plus 6 is 11, plus 1 is 0 is 11. So 1, 1 carry. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Right. So, so it is 25 plus 16 plus 30, which we are going to write in the numerator. 6 plus 5 is 11. So 1, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 71 divided by 40 times 3 is 120, right? So that is the average value of all these numbers, correct? So we can write down our answer as average is 71 over 120, right? It is better to write in fractions. If you are required to write in decimals, you could always use your calculator and then find approximate value, which could be 1 point, let's say 6, right? Round it to 0 0.6, I'm sorry. Okay, but anyway, it is always better to write in fractions. So I hope you get the concept. The idea of finding averages, add all the numbers and divide by the number of numbers. To add fractions, we should have common denominator. Look for lowest common denominator, right? 
So how do we do that? We find multiples of each, right? So 8 multiples are 8, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, and so on. 5 multiples are 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, but we do have 40, right? Similarly, in force multiple, we have 4, 8, and so on, and we do have 40. So 40 is the lowest common multiple. That was the reason why we made all these denominators equal to 40. So these are equivalent fractions. So we wrote them as equivalent fraction. Once you write as equivalent fractions, same denominator, you can just add the numerators, right? And then divide the whole thing by three. That's what you get. I hope the steps are clear. I'm Anil Kumar. You are most welcome to share your questions and I'll post the solutions at the earliest. Thank you and all the best.